Well, let's go now to the Gaza border in southern Israel and get the very latest from our security and defence editor, Deborah Haynes. She is there on the border. Deborah, uh, you are there with the Israeli troops. What can you tell us? Yeah, I'm not on the border. I am in southern Israel and I'm with the Givati Brigade. They're about to conduct a training exercise. This is a combat-ready unit. They're ready to go into Gaza should the order come. And right now you can see uh, soldiers driving past us as they go forward. They're simulating the kind of exercise, the kind of action that they would have to do if they are called to go into Gaza. This is a very highly trained, highly professional unit. They were, it was a unit that went into Gaza back in 2014. I've been speaking to uh, military people here who say to me that this unit is absolutely ready to go. Many of them are reservists. They've just been called up since the Hamas attack just over a week ago. A lot of them have been fighting to repel that assault and now they are getting ready in case they are told that these, are go these units are going to have to go into Gaza. And what we're going to be seeing is this unit in action training. Um, they've got tanks, uh, they've got foot soldiers. There's also an engineering element that can deal with bombs, detonating bombs. They're expecting uh, most likely that there will be um, booby traps and explosives in Gaza if they did have to go in. And like any military unit, of course, they have to train. And so uh, we've been allowed to come and watch them as they are in this training. It was described to me as absolutely vital training, given the fact that the Israeli military said last night that they are preparing for potential of land, sea, air operations, combined manoeuvres, uh, with a focus on large ground operations. And if that were to come to pass, then it's almost certain that the Givati Brigade will be in, would be involved in going into Gaza.